All right, here's the walkthrough video tour for 200 Meadow Beauty Terrace. This house is a Beezer home and is within the beautiful community of Barrington Club. Uh, it has about 134 homes within this community and the nice thing about uh, these properties is that the lots are very wide. So you're not on top of each other. Um, as I mentioned, the house was built in 1999 and uh, the property is a little bit over 2,500 square feet. So this house provides a beautiful entryway, beautiful tiled floors, Carvel and Nye area. Just imagine after a long week of work, grab your favorite adult beverage and relax by the front door here. So this house is a four bedroom, two bath, three way split floor plan, which is very desirable, which means you have the master suite on one side, two bedrooms on another, and then you also have a separate fourth bedroom with an attached uh, um, bathroom to it. This is the dining room. Beautiful, tall, tray ceilings. This floor plan really makes it feel like it's a really open floor plan. Beautiful shutters here, plantation shutters. So we switch back over here, we go into a very large, spacious um, living room. This also has beautiful shutters that they put in. Crown molding throughout. What I find a lot of people doing in this particular room is actually converting it into an office. If you look at the doorway here, people really convert that and put in two French doors and that makes a very nice size office for somebody. All right, if we look over here, we have a very large family room. You'll find that all the carpet in here is fairly new. Beautiful fireplace with a nice high white mantle. Nice high ceilings throughout with crown molding throughout. Very well done. All right. And this opens up nicely to the back patio, which we'll see in just a minute. Before we go there, we're going to take a look at the kitchen. Kitchen's been updated with beautiful granite countertops, stainless steel appliances. Already had beautiful cabinets. Got a center island, as you see. Even even has a little spot here for a little, a little workbench on the side. Now, right next to that is going to be the kitchen nook. Perfect for those mornings getting up, grab some Joe, get the paper at the front door. All right. Now we're going to take a trip into the master suite. Master suite, once again, has the brand new carpet that we talked about. Very spacious. Now the nice thing about it is that it does open up nicely to the uh, porch area here, which we'll get to. And then here we have the master bathroom. Two separate sink areas. All right, updated light fixtures. We have a garden tub. We have a separate sink here, so you have two sinks. And you have a large walk-in closet here. I'm gonna show you this here. All right, you have the commode, and you have a large shower here. All right, I'm pretty proud of myself. I didn't uh, show myself in any of the mirrors. All right, so we're gonna walk around here and go through the kitchen and take a look at that again, and we're gonna take a look at the two of the three wings of the house. 
go ahead and show you while we're here. We have a nice walk-in pantry. Nice and high too. So this is the second wing. So we have uh, laminate floors that are put in here. This is a fourth bedroom. They've converted this into an office, which you could do as well, unless you do the other room. Now this has an attached full bathroom as well. All right, got a shower, everything there. All right. All right. Here we have the laundry room, which is right off the garage. Nice thing about the laundry room is that you have cabinets as well, a little wash area here, a little separate sink for you. Now the garage is full, but I want to share it with you because it's, it's an oversized two car garage. And if I get the light here, there we go. So you can fit two cars in the garage and you have all this extra space up front. So if you lived up north, this is sort of like your basement. I've seen people in this neighborhood that actually convert this into like a game room, which you could do as well if you wanted to, but it has plenty of extra space to allow you to do that. All right. We're gonna walk through the dining room again here. Okay. And we're gonna take a look at the other two bedrooms as well as the second bathroom. All right. So this is one of the, let's say it's the third bedroom. Now the nice thing about this closet, I don't know if you can see this, but it goes all the way through to the other side. So it has plenty of room. Nice size. Nice thing you'll like about these is that they do have a lot of room uh, for beds and whatnot. I'm gonna go down the hallway here. And this is the fourth bedroom. And the nice thing about this bedroom is that it has a nice walk-in closet here, which we're gonna take a look at. So plenty of room, stacked up as well. All right, on the other, this is the guest bathroom, which is also a pool bath if you had a pool. One of the things you're going to notice about this house is that it is very well maintained, very clean. The people that own this house were very meticulous. You can just tell as you walk through it. Okay. And then we're going to, without giving my face in the video here, let's go up to the back patio. Now, when they built this house, they actually extended out the Cumberland Eye area as you can see. And they put in a screen on top of it. So it's a very large area, nice place to put a hot tub, great place to grill out. So we're giving you a different view here. So very large, very large. Now, the other thing that they did here is they actually put in a paver deck. This is the backyard. Nice size backyard. Plenty of room for a pool if you want to put a pool in yourself. And a nice side yard. This home is within the 
Barrington Club neighborhood, directly across the street from an A plus, A plus uh, elementary school, Wilson Elementary. So if you're interested in seeing this property, please let us know. Thank you.